Hello everyone, I have a great rustic chicken pie for you today. It is a super crunchy and tasty pie. The filo gives it such a beautiful appearance. It's impressive and different. Your friends and family will love it. First of all, we need a pan, a huge pan. Put it on the heat, turn on the heat, and let it become extremely hot. Now, I have plenty of veggies here. Peppers, carrots, and onion. And I will chop them. One onion. It's a rustic pie, so don't bother for the size of the veggies. Just chop them. One carrot. Quarter it. And peppers. My veggies are ready. Now, extra virgin Greek olive oil. Three tablespoons. And look at those colors. This beauty means that our food will be very, very tasty also. Inside the pan. And let them caramelize for three to five minutes. While we are cooking the veggies, let's prepare the mushroom. You can slice them, you can quarter them, you can do whatever you want. Now. Now. Come here and add all the spices. Paprika. Curry powder. And some nutmeg. Bravo. Now, cook the spices with the veggies so they will aromatize the veggies and add the mushrooms. Now, add the chicken. I have cooked chicken here. You can boil it or you can roast it. And we cook for 10 minutes. At this point, guys, can you see that? The chicken starts to caramelize. My veggies starts to caramelize also. And we need to give body to this stuffing. Now, deglaze first with white wine. Let it evaporate and add the heavy cream. Not a lot, just to take the right consistency. Mix. Take off the heat. And add the rest of the ingredients. We need two eggs. One, two. Create cheese. Pepper, salt, and some chopped parsley. Mix very well. This is so yummy. Oh my God. The stuffing is ready. And let's prepare our pie. I need a nice baking dish and I need filo. Five hundred grams of filo would be enough. I think that you can find filo in every supermarket. And I need, of course, olive oil and I will brush my pan. Then, I will put the half filos at the bottom of the pan. The first one, sprinkle with olive oil, and carry on with the rest. When you put the half of the filo at the stuffing, 
it is delicious. And carry on with the rest filo. The same exactly procedure. Filo, olive oil, filo, olive oil, filo, olive oil. And the last one. Press a little bit and then turn the edges inward, like this. To create a thick and crunchy crust. This is the beauty of the Greek cuisine. So simple, yet so tasty. Brush with some more extra virgin Greek olive oil. Now it's time to score it. And of course, in Greece we love sesame. Bravo. And it's time for the oven. Bake this lovely pie for 50 minutes to one hour to 100 degrees Celsius set to fun. Then take it out and let it rest for half an hour and then we will cut it into pieces. And my pie is ready. It smells so nice and it's time to take this lovely pie off the pan. And the most amazing moments with these pies is when you have to cut them. You have to hear that. This is delicious. This is not a simple chicken pie. This is the ultimate chicken pie. Look at that. The filling is so aromatic with all this uh, spices inside, all these veggies, the chicken, and of course the cheese. And the outside, it is just crunchy. I can't describe this pie, you have to do it. And now, you have to subscribe to my channel, push that button, you have to push it once. <laughs> Please make comments underneath the video. You can make Greek comments if you know any Greeks. And please share this lovely recipe with your friends. See you, bye-bye. Yes, -bye. us.